Hey guys, this is Nash back with another ROM plus kernel combo. So recently I installed Pixel 3 OS on my phone. So in this video, I will flash Fango kernel in this ROM and will show you battery life and gaming performance. And at the end of this video, we will also show you how to install this kernel. So let's get started. So guys, Pixel 3 ROM itself is an outstanding ROM, very stable and smooth experience. It basically gives you Pixel experience on your phone. And the good thing is, it's available for many phones. So with the normal kernel, I got decent battery life, but I wanted more. So I flashed Franco kernel, and the results are outstanding. I got more than 8 hours of screen on time with battery remaining of 40%. And eventually at the end, I got 10 hours of screen on time where I was constantly using messenger app and playing some games and my brightness was at 100% all the time. And because of this kernel, the multitasking experience was also smooth, like I had so many apps running in the background and still I was able to play games without any lag or glitch. So that was my battery life on this kernel. Now let's have a look at some benchmarks. And now we are going to play PUBG which is everybody's current favorite game right now. So I didn't find any lag or glitch so far, the phone is just warm and not overheated. And I played this game for half an hour and I just lost 2% of battery life. But my brightness was at 80%. Along with PUBG, this kernel also handles Shadow Fight 3 very well. The gameplay is quite smooth as you can see. So in my opinion, Franco kernel is really outstanding kernel and it's as good as Electra Blue kernel and the good thing is you can flash this kernel on any custom ROM as long as it's based on Android Oreo. And now I will show you how to install this kernel on your phone. So I'm using Redmi Note 4 Snapdragon variant and currently I'm running Pixel 3 OS on my phone. You can flash this kernel on any custom ROM but make sure it's based on Android Oreo. So first of all download the kernel and put that in your internal storage and then reboot into your recovery and before you do anything in TWRP recovery make sure you take full Android backup. Go to install tab, locate the kernel and swipe right to flash and then reboot it. So your phone must reboot in less than 5 minutes. If it doesn't, then something is wrong and now you have to repeat the process or you can restore your Android backup. So that was my base room and kernel combo episode number 3. You can watch episode number 1 and 2 in iButton along with Pixel 3 OS full review. And as always, all the downloads will be in the description box below and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to like it. This is your friend Nair signing out and I will see you tomorrow. Ooh.